Welcome back to the 2015 Bridgestone World Solar Challenge. We're still here in Adelaide at the finish line. Although yesterday, a lot of the leading Challenger classes crossed the line. Today, we've got more of the Challenger classes coming in and of course the Cruiser class cars making their way in. It's nowhere near over and done with yet. There's still much to be won and done. <laughs> Uh, my name is AJ, I'm from Western Sydney University Solar Car Project. We just arrived into Adelaide in 10th uh, place. We are so stoked to be here, my team has been amazing, the car has been amazing. We're now on display for the next four days and look, we couldn't have done it without our partners. All of our partners, from Bridgestone to all of the others, look, we couldn't have done it without you. And look, at the end of the day, we've travelled 3,000 kilometres on solar power in a car we've built ourselves. I'm absolutely amazed and stoked and I can't wait to take a break. Okay, we're joined here by Andrew Moffat, Managing Director of Bridgestone Australia and New Zealand. Um, Andrew, I've got to say, mate, this, this is my first time uh, on this challenge and I have been blown away, um, not only by, I keep saying the team's passion and camaraderie, but just how far and how hard they're pushing technology. And, and I've got to be honest, you know, you know what can be achieved with the sun, but I am surprised by it. This must be just such an amazing event for you guys to be a part of, and I'm sure you're proud, am I right? We are, Shane. We are incredibly proud to be associated with the Bridgestone World Solar Challenge. More than 40 teams represented here from over 20 countries. It's an amazing event. I've been blown away by the technology. I've seen the tyre technology at work. We've seen all that happen, but the other technology in the car is also fantastic. It's an amazing challenge, Shane, and to see those guys and girls sitting in those cars in extreme conditions, covering huge distances, sharing the road with normal road users, including road trains, I think they're brave people, but I think they do an amazing job, and it's a really exciting event. It's great to see.